Having fun? Yeah. Good. Welcome back. <laughs> I'm Ant. And I'm Deck. And this is Wanna Bet, the show where ordinary people claim they can do extraordinary things. After three challenges tonight, our leader is Jerry with $31,000. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> But all of that could change with this, our final challenge of the evening. Please welcome the Valet Babes. Hey! How are you? Hey! Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Hi, how are you? Hi. Hi. Welcome Hi. to Wanna Bet. Tell us, girls, what do you do for a living? Well, we are all um, valet girls. Um, we are actually an all-female valet parking company from LA. Okay, if you're from LA, yes. what what kind of customers do you normally deal with when, when you're valet parking? We we have a lot of different types. Uh, we do a lot yes, of celebrities. Oh, yeah. I see. Hotties. Hotties. <laughs> hotties. What are hotties? Yes. You guys are hotties, of course. Well, thank, thank you. Thank you. I don't know what a hottie is, but thank you. Well, <laughs> well now you know. Yeah. But you would say that you're very good at your job, yeah? Yeah, we're yeah. probably one of the best. One of the best? Yeah. We're like the best in the world. The best in the world? Oh. 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 In fact, the valet babes here claim they are so expert at parking and retrieving the luxury cars of Hollywood's elite that they can retrieve our car, our special car that has been surrounded by a sea of 50 black cars. <laughs> and they can park it in our Wanna Bet parking space all in under two and a half minutes. Yes! <laughs> Quite a claim. <laughs> if, when time runs out, our car is not in the space or any of the cars get damaged in the process, they will have failed the challenge and they certainly won't get a tip from us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Girls, you go and get yourselves prepared outside. We will see you outside. Let's hear it one more time for the Valley okay. Babes. Yeah. See you outside. So, panel, make your predictions and final wagers now. We'll reveal them when the challenge is over. It's time for us to go outside and join the girls. Oh, we just need a, a microphone. Ah, here we go. Thank you, Dave. Thank you. I don't know who he is. I don't know who he is. Uh, Thank you, check on the girls. And here they are. How are you doing, girls? Good? Yeah. Feeling good? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Right. OK, let's just recap, then. What you have to do is Get out there, take a look, work out some kind of way to get the car out, get back, get the keys, and deliver the Mini here with no scratches. Remember, it's our car, so please be careful. Yeah, let's put two and a half minutes on the clock for you. That's your time. The very best of luck, Valet girls. The bet is on! <laughs> So they're off, they've got to decide which cars to get out of the way first, then find the keys, then start the cars, then move them. Run like the wind. 31 OK, they've figured out what keys they need. They're just going to get the keys now, take it back to the cars and start moving. Each of the girls taking a car. In order. Every second count, in order. Oh, OK. You see the mini is right in the middle of all those cars. It's, uh, okay, it's yeah. quite tricky. Ooh, Ooh that was quick. They're off at speed. The cars are moving. They're like skilled oh. surgeons behind the wheels of those cars. Well, I don't know about that. And they do have to be careful as well not to run each other over. Yes, that's for the obvious. They're doing well. They're moving quite a few now. I think I can see their plan. You see the little hole there? Yeah. Yeah. OK, girls, that's one minute gone. Minute and a half left. Oh, that was close. Did you see that? That was a bit of a close shave there. Going back to the other cars. Still a lot of cars to get through. These girls are quick. They are quick, and they've got to be quick because it's just over a minute to go. Oh, this is going to be close. This yeah. is going to be close. They've got to move those black cars. Get this mini out. Get it on the carpet. we the time. Come on, girls. Can they do it in under a minute? I'm afraid to look. Oh, so the mini's moving. The mini's moving. But can they, can they oh, navigate the way around? Come on, girls. Watch the camera now. Watch the cars. No scratches, no dents. 40 seconds. 40 seconds left. Here we go. <laughs> Remember, 
must be on the red car. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. left on the clock. <laughs> and we'll find out how much our celebrities wagered and reveal tonight's winner when we return with more One of X. Well done, girl. Well done. Ah. Welcome back to One of Bet. Before the break, we saw the Valet Babes succeed in their claim that they could retrieve our car that was surrounded by a sea of 50 black cars and deliver it intact in under two and a half minutes. It's time to find out how our celebrity panel predicted and revealed their wages. Remember, how they bet here will determine tonight's big winner. Drew, let's start with you. How much did you bet on that last challenge? I bet... $13,749. Okay. <laughs> Very particular. Uh, Rondell, of your 5,000 big ones there. Does it really matter how much <laughs> money? You knew it was going to be 5,000. He's yes. gone for the lot. <laughs> Melissa? Yes. How much did you bet? I, I believe in dreaming big. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I went $15,000. $15,000. Wow. And finally, Jerry, our current leader. What did you go for, Jerry? I only went $5,000. $5,000 here for Jerry. So, so things go. could all change. All right, this is it. It's time to reveal your predictions and discover who is tonight's big winner. Rondell, let's start with you. Um, we want to know whether you said the girls would succeed or fail. Was there another option? Was that there was they could trip and burst into flames? <laughs> I honestly didn't think they were going to be able to do it in two and a half minutes. I thought they were going to fail. You said fail, <laughs> which leaves you at the end of the show with nothing. <laughs> Drew, you bet $13,749, but which way did you predict? What did you go for? Well, for the whole show, I've been the eternal optimist. And, you know, I've always gone for what the people said they could do. I, I went with my gut. Yeah? Until this time. Oh! <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, I said that they, not that they would fail, but that they just wouldn't succeed. Okay. Yes. 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 Which in my book means it's a fail, which takes your total for this evening down to a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry, let's go to you now. Current leader. What did you say, succeed or fail? Succeed for me. Succeed? Well done. So I beat you, Drew. It was a succeed for Jerry. I beat you. <laughs> that takes Jerry's total to $36,000. A good total, Jerry. And congratulations on beating Drew in your rematch. Melissa, which way did you go? $15,000. Was it succeed or fail? I myself have been known to parallel park and shave my legs at the same time. <laughs> but I knew that the ladies were going to succeed in this challenge, and they did me proud! Melissa said succeed, which takes her total for the evening of two. I uh, thank you. $43,000. Wow. That means, Melissa, wow. you are tonight's winner. Please just remind us which charity that's going to. Uh, the money's going to a great charity. It is called First Witness. It's a child abuse resource center in my home state of Minnesota. Well, they're $43,000 better off thanks to you, Melissa. Woo! Well done. Well done, Melissa. Let's thank the Valet Babes. And all of our challenges this evening, let's also thank our celebrity panelists, Drew Lachey, Rondell Sheridan, Melissa Peterman, and Jerry Rice. <laughs> That's all we've got time for tonight. We will see you next time with more fantastic celebrities, more daring wagers, and more ordinary people doing extraordinary things on one of us. See you next time, everybody. Good night.